debate last night where there were some people saying, look, actually, it's, it's so bad that they, will, they might just do something in the short term. There might be some kind of deal between the new president and a, and a Congress, or do you think that's, it's not likely to really come through? Well, I, I, I think it depends who's the president, yeah. because I, you know, I, I believe all the work that's been done so far was the assumption that President Obama was going to be reelected. And I think they were working on all the different types of platforms they could do. I think the issue is if, if uh, Governor Romney is elected, I think there's a lot more work to be done. Uh, Governor Romney made some very large statements related to how he would fix the economy, which includes tax reductions and a few other things. And that's going to be a very difficult thing to do in front of a fiscal cliff. So there has to be some form of pivot one way or another and, and how we do it. My view is um, they're going to come with some below agreement they're going to announce a three to four hundred million dollar deficit cut during the um, uh, uh, during the lame duck session, and with the idea that they will defer everything for six Pretty months, yeah. and and hopefully during that period of time there is real process and real um, and a real process in which they worked it towards a resolution. I had two senators visit me this past week, and both involved. One person was part of the uh, a Gang of Eight, and that's how I'm getting this information, and they were telling me all this, and I said, well, if you're gonna push, push it off for six months, can you do one thing for the American population? He said, what's it? I said, can you make sure that until this is fixed, there's no congressional recess, that they stay there the whole time and get the job done. Now, I, obviously, he, he couldn't speak for the Congress, but I, I, you know, w whether it's a three-month deferral or a six-month deferral, we need to see as citizens of America that our Congress is really attacking this and doing it well. And I think one symbolic way is that they're not taking vacations. They are there working towards truly fixing our problem.